ladies and gentlemen, your boy just got home from the gym, and my god, what a thing to come home to. We have ourselves some pretty big news to discuss in regards to the Smogon competitive Pokemon community. We have ourselves not only Chien Pao being banned as a result of suspect test voting, but Espathra got banned as well. That right there was just completely crazy because I was not expecting for Espathra to just suddenly get banned up and out of nowhere. There wasn't even a suspect test for it, at least I don't think. But let's look deeper into this, ladies and gentlemen. Well, make no wonder this felt like it was completely left field. This was a quick ban of Espathra, and out of the nine council members for OU, every single one of them voted ban. This was absolutely unanimous. Now, if we take a look at Espathra, for those that don't know what this Pokemon is, it is a pure psychic type with the abilities Frisk, Opportunist, and Speed Boost, with the stats going like this. 95 HP, 60s in the Attack, Defense, and Special Defense, 101 in the Special Attack, and 105 in the Speed. Now, its bread and butter usually revolves around the combination of Speed Boost and Calm Mind, along with Stored Power. Basically how something like that would break down, long story short, Speed Boost boosts your speed by one stage at the end of every turn, Calm Mind boosts your special attack and special defense by one stage per use, and we have Stored Power, which initially starts off at base 20 power, but the more stat increases that you gain, the stronger Stored Power gets. So you guys can begin to put two and two together as to how strong this Pokemon could be if it's not immediately dealt with. So I'm going to say this, I do not agree with Quick Bands unless it's absolutely necessary, and to be honest with you, I would be more or less understanding if they suspect tested Espathra, but the fact that they went right back to quick banning things, that doesn't exactly sit well with me because, in my honest opinion, I think any time that there is a decision to be made, there should be community involvement rather than having things decided for the community. But that's just my opinion. I do kind of sort of understand where they're coming from here. But now let's address Chien Pao. So we have ourselves a Finchinator posting. Although not all of the users who have earned voting requisites have voted yet, their vote will not affect the outcome of the vote. Eligible voters 177, votes 155. Chien Pao, ban 107, do not ban 48. Ban percentage equals 69.3%. And it takes a 60% pro-ban majority for there to be a ban. So 69% is evidently ban-worthy. Now this here is a little less surprising. I kind of expected for Chien Pao to be banned anyways because... Even though that Pokemon isn't the bulkiest and Ice and Dark isn't the best defensive typing, hello Mock Punch users, this Pokemon has the ability to absolutely shred through unprepared teams. Like, this Pokemon is absolutely crazy busted. So there's not really much else to be said here in this video, ladies and gentlemen. I kind of wanted to get this news across to you to get your opinions on this. Personally, I don't feel all that great about Espathra being quick banned. Suspect tested, that right there would have been honestly more appropriate in my opinion. Now as far as Chien Pao being banned from Smogon OU to Ubers, it doesn't exactly surprise me all that much. I kind of felt like that something like this was going to happen one way or another. The Pokemon, even though it doesn't have really good defensive typing with Ice and Dark, especially making it four times weak to fighting moves, this Pokemon is a powerhouse. It is an absolute unit. Like I said before, this Pokemon will shred through unprepared teams. So let me know your thoughts about this in the comments down below, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you for your time as well in viewing this video. Have yourself a damn good one, you beautiful people. I'll see you next time.